There's a difference between a criticism and a complaint. One carries a judgment and one carries a request. When we are criticizing, we are judging. But when we are complaining, we're really appealing for something better to happen. When we get these two things mixed up, and we do all the time, it creates a necessary um, conflict and division between us. And often a complaint is heard and felt as a criticism because we didn't say it well. And I've been guilty of that, and I guess you have too. We, we, we had an unhelpful energy attached to our complaint. Um, we used the wrong words, didn't phrase it well, picked a wrong time. So it was felt as a criticism, and so the request for something better to happen wasn't heard and didn't take place. I'm appealing to us in this video to have a greater emotional, relational radar and intelligence for the difference between these two things, criticism and complaint. You know, a complaint can really be a veiled compliment, can't it? If I said to you, um, I miss you because you're not here, you're working all the time. You can hear that as a criticism that you're a workaholic. Or you can hear it as a complaint that I would love to have more time with you and I can't because you work all the time. And so I miss you. So it's a compliment. But I think if we are, if we are wired to see everything as a criticism and we're over defensive, then the complaints that we should be hearing never have the effect of the requests being heard and better things occurring. So stop hearing everything as a criticism and increase your intelligence to tune in to the complaint, even if it's not being said well.